Let's reprise Weird Ways to Curl Your Hair right now on Beauty Break. Welcome. How was that? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Beauty Break. Don't we look lovely? We do. We just like rolled out of bed, curlers and hair, and popped on into the office. Because I always sleep with curlers in my hair. Every single night. Never. Nope. Never not done even this. once. Actually, this was the first time. I don't know if you guys know, if you're OG fans, you do. Mm -hmm. One of our most successful episodes that put us on the map. Was Weird ways to curl your hair. Uh, what she said. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god! <laughs> I've never felt more alive in my life. That one really put us on the map. Mm -hmm. um, it was one of my first appearances on camera. Your boobs. Even. My boobs. Made an my mom was not thrilled about that as usual. <laughs> but anyway, we thought we would reprise our best episode and do more weird ways to curl your hair. Let's go. Let's reprise it. This episode is brought to you by Invisalign Treatment. Get straight teeth two times faster. Okay, what should we begin with? Well, I think we should we be I think we should begin with inserting the vlog of Lily putting her curlers in last night. Oh, we should. Insert here. I wish you guys could see right now that I'm using literally like a deodorant and my faucet to prop up the camera right now. Okay, Joss and I have decided to split the curlers because we only ordered one pack. It says that you're supposed to do it like after you get out of the shower, but that you're supposed to do it on like damp hair. If you have thick hair, 80% of it should be dry. I don't really know how you gauge percentages there. So I'm just going to wet my brush, which is a little difficult because I put the phone on the faucet. Yeah, oh, Rip out my extensions. So it feels a little damp. I don't know if I'd say 80%, but I'll say it counts. Start in the back. Should we do the bottom pieces? I don't know. Let's do some top ones. We can re-straighten those later. Okay, so it's these little foamy things. It's literally just fabric around pieces of foam. Guess you start at the bottom. Sure. Okay. I don't know if that was completely correct. This seems like more work, to be honest. Putting them in seems much more aggressive than just having to curl it. I feel like I'm not doing it right, so then it unwrap. Well, we'll see. I think my phone has enough space because this is gonna take me 10 years. You are supposed to do it from the bottom, right? Like, I'm not stupid. Well, I probably am stupid, but just lie to me. I'm gonna just try from up here. Oh, 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 oh. It did seem like that one stayed where I put it longer. I, this could potentially work. Well, I'm ready for bed. Can you tell? That was magical. It was. Um, it was me in my bathroom alone at like 10 because I forgot to do it. Mm. Guess who else forgot to do it until this morning? Me! So there, insert vlog. Just kidding, there is no vlog because I just put these in. Lucky for you all, I already have an afro, so it's going to be amazing. Thanks. Anyway, so um, I'm not great with curlers, as you might imagine. Two of them <sighs> fell out while I was sleeping. This one looks so so in. Well, because <laughs> then also you really did yours tight up to well, the why roots. Did, why didn't you do yours because to the roots? Because I can't curl up here since this is my real hair and this is the fake hair. Let's reveal the, the luxurious curls. So the point of these ones, what's it called? The sleep styler? These are called the sleep styler. Oh. Should be plural because there's multiple of them. Mm -hmm. You already did the sleeping. But is that is that why? Because they feel good when you sleep? Like I, yeah, they're soft. They're just like little foam nuggets. I, I also <laughs> I used to do we the also sponge curlers. We only had one pack. That's why we each only have half of our heads. Lily, done. it's actually to showcase straight side, curly side. That's totally why. Know. We wanted it really live before and after. Um, I used to sleep in those sponge rollers before like cheer. Ooh. That is a nice curl. Oh, look at mine. This has only been in you guys for like literally 45 minutes. Maybe you need to brush that one but out. But we know, we know how my hair really loves to accept its rightful place in the curl community. Her celebrity doppelganger, it's more of a character doppelganger, is Chutney from Legally Blonde. Lil, look at how good these were. This does work. But I will say that while I was doing it, I felt like the process was no different than just actually curling my hair. Like I was having to just individually curl the pieces But no anyway. heat styling. I mean, look at this. Oh, that's why you're I not love burning that that didn't hair. occur to me when I'm the one that has like fried hair and like needs to really be concerned. Look! <laughs> oh my god. Honestly, so I'm going to recommend um, my technique of putting them maybe for more natural curls down towards the bottom. But I think if I gave it like a nice little tussle. Do you know how like guys always think like girls wake up in the morning like just looking like a Victoria's Secret model? First of all, I don't. I don't this think guys is think really. That. What does your boyfriend think when you wake? <laughs> He's definitely fully like 
laughed in my face. He has before. kind of crazy hair too. He has crazy I feel like he hair. probably has worse bed head than you. Yeah. I would highly recommend these if you want to avoid heat styling. Now I see the positive. Otherwise, it felt like it was more time consuming than just curling your hair. These are also antimicrobial, which is so nice. You could probably throw these in the washing machine. It means like it gets rid of gets rid of germs. <laughs> Moving on, this looks like some kind of like <laughs> wiener gun. <laughs> or like a ghost detector, you know? <laughs> exactly, like, that's like my thoughts, exactly. <laughs> You've been watching too many of Jade and Ryland's haunted videos. <laughs> so um, what do you do? I don't, don't do it so close to the root. Okay, I'll do the, I'll do the fake hair. Because we have stuff to do after this. <laughs> do we though? Yes, the quirl bar. Quirling. Innovative ergonomic oh. design. So is it like easier for your wrist so you don't get like carpal tunnel from too much curling? Oh, that didn't work. Okay, I'm gonna yeah. try. I don't really have a problem with a normal curling iron, so. But this is kind of nice that you're not like, oh, and I just burned myself so we know it's hot. <laughs> oh, that one worked. <laughs> I was like, which one? <laughs> Fight through the quirls. <laughs> this one. Wait, let me try. I think it's more of a, that you need to try it yourself. Oh yeah, to so get the ergonomic. Isn't that what they like, ergonomic is like when a chair is like good for your back? Or you don't even sit, you just stand all day. Or you sit on a bouncy ball or something okay, weird Okay, okay, like I take back my judgment. This is nice. I will totally use this. And I like that the thing I don't the bottom, feel like I have to be like holding my arm up quite as much. It's a good barrel size. This Let is really see. nice. Ooh, well, that's such a nice like curl. My hair is just like a nest right now, but okay. Well, so that's like pretty this. awesome. So this thing is pretty cool, and I know people who have lobs that use these instead of a curling iron or like a bob, okay. which neither of us It's clearly. a larger, oh. it's like a blow dryer curler brush. Ooh, it feels so warm. It feels really good. Ooh! Ah. Am I fashion yet? Like a nice- Can we, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is really what I just think looks really nice. You guys? <laughs> just a nice bed head mix. This is very nice and voluminous. This gets a little weird. I'm like a living before and after. This, okay, I will say that this is something that you like, it looks like you just left a salon. Sometimes I don't like my hair when I leave the salon. Cause it's too, like, It's like too boomsy. perfect. It's like, <laughs> boom, boom, boom. What did you just say? <laughs> Poofy boomsy. <laughs> you know how that feels on your skull? It does. He feels great. I would almost do this as an at-home spa treatment. It for some reason did make it look a little less greasy. It's really crazy. It looks great. Nice sheen. I like it. I love this poofy bootsy. What's it called? <laughs> it's our um, Revlon. Revlon. Revlon makes hair products. Did I know that? Didn't they do the InStyler? Was that them? The anyway. Beach Waver? <laughs> I know so much about beauty products. What is this waffle maker we've got over here? Okay, so I guess this isn't all ways to curl your hair. We lied. <laughs> Hold on, what does that do? Looks like a crimper but you could also make waffles with it. I would That's love to neat. actually try to make waffles with this one time. Volume petite? Volume petite. Not Wait. volume, volume. Volume. Part hair normally. Section off the top layer, use volume petite. Oh, on What's the on? under layers. So we don't want to really get the waffled look. You just want to, it's like getting a, just more volume yeah, without a bump it. So this just gives you like, how long do we hold it on? Let's read these directs. Oh, as desired. It extends time between shampoos. It adds for days. It also transforms up to's and ponytails. It's great for travel or after a workout. It wouldn't be worth it. <laughs> oh my uh, gosh. What it's a, it's what hard idea. to test a volume tool on Dawson's hair because there's already so much volume. It looks pretty much like a crimp. Okay. And not, not a cute crimp. Like if it accidentally got exposed, it wouldn't be something you want people to see. I but would, if it was really just volumizing the underneath. And you trim. can't do this if you have extensions because too much heat like this won't make them come off, melt off. We have one more tool. Oh, wow. It's, Did we borrow this from my grandma? Is it, is it gonna be hot? It's warm, <laughs> it's warm. Okay. Like popcorn. Um, so in an episode of Beauty Trippin', I might be getting a shag bang. Can't do you guys think wait. that's on trend? What do you think? I don't know. One like time, a dangle shagger? One time Erin wore fake bangs on an episode of DHR and everyone told her that she didn't have any friends because real friends would have told her not to do that. I thought she looked cute for the record. I didn't. I warned her before she went on air and she didn't listen. I felt like people wanted to sexualize me. So what does this do? Well, I think you're done. I think that it's an accessory, not a hair stylist. Gosh. 
I love this thing though. This is awesome. The Revlon thing. Yeah, while well, that so heats up, that. let's get our final consensus. I okay. think those are great. Yep. And I should use those so I don't fry my hair anymore mm -hmm. because yep. if you look, some of these pieces are real short. But it's I, your hair is a lot healthier than it once well, like, was. Look at like how long this one is. And then these ones got like, I have a random piece that's real short. <laughs> it's grown a lot though. It has. And if you Keep need going. another trim in the future, you know I'm here for you. No thanks. Anyway, so I think I should use those more often. This is pretty nice. It's very fancy. That was probably the most expensive thing, right? Probably. It that looks was, expensive. Was pretty expensive. The volume was expensive. Yeah. This goes. isn't, this is still heat styling, but this was nice. I will, as soon as the shoot is over, use this on the rest of my hair. Here, do you wanna try it on a piece? Try it on the, over here. It is really like, for your hair not being wet at all, I feel like it's really getting out all the curls we just put in. I like this thing a lot. Let me fix your weird little cowlick back there. Thanks, girl. This is really nice. I would recommend this. I think this is the coolest thing. It makes your hair soft. And normally we've tried these like kind of blow dryer brushy things and they always feel is like that all your hair soft or is your hair just really soft? Oh, it's soft, <laughs> I think. I don't know. My but but also like I don't have my hair is deceptively looks like there's a lot but truthfully my hair is like one rat tail. It's just a very Yeah, there's not that much. Tail. It's like a little tiny ponytail. Like when I do braids, it's like the mm. saddest day of my life. Would you like to I do the honors? I can already tell that this is going to be just lovely. Let's keep it in full bang, you know? It's just a little too long. I, yeah, we could always trim it really quick for you. We could. I think we're done. I feel beautiful. You look great. Anyway, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell because we would love to keep our jobs. 100%. Please follow us on the social meds if you want to stay in touch. I'm at Jocelyn Davis and she's at Lily underscore Marston. And thank you so much for watching. Goodbye. Stay in touch. <laughs> K-I-T. Call your landline later. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I have a landline apparently. Bye. <laughs> That's what she said. Swag, swag, swag. Stop. On you. The no, blonde no. and it, oh, I wish this was mid episode and we I don't could insert that clip of you rapping to that. We'll do that later. Put that at the end of the episode, Nicole. Oh. What you like, yeah, tell me what you don't. I could be a buzz light, yeah, fly across the globe. I don't ever want to fight, yeah, you already know. Thanks again to Invisalign Treatment for sponsoring this episode. Click the link in the description below to check out the Invisalign Smile Quiz. Click to the left to watch Erin's new show, What the Flavor, where her and Lily make fried desserts.